One of the things about Things Fall Apart is the way it continues to speak uh, to us, just like it spoke to uh, the students you talked about in Korea. What kind of story does an Anglophone Cameroonian write, especially when to the left he has uh, French Cameroon, to the right he has neighboring Nigeria that's also so huge. So we are stuck there in the, in the, in the middle. And as we celebrate the 50th anniversary of Things Fall Apart, that novel that inspired many writers, what would you say to the writers in this little enclave who seem to be grappling with this? And not oh, that's something they, they have to find out themselves. Uh, and um, you see, that uncomfortable, well, uh, forget the word you use for that little enclave or something, um, that has a story. That that feeling of being the little, uh, almost forgotten member uh, um, tucked away there. There's a huge story there. You see, the mistake many people make is to think that uh, a successful story uh, is successful because it is big or because it is somebody else's story that has worked. So I don't have something, you, you hear some people say, uh, we were not, um, uh, I was not taught my culture. What do I do? Well, the fact that you were not taught your culture is a big story, you see. Um, we mustn't, wait for a story that looks like somebody else's story before we can recognize our, um, our possibility. Uh, you see, the, the Cameroonians, I went to school with, with them. Because mm -hmm. at, the, at that time, every term, a certain number of Cameroonians would come to my It was part of so I knew a number of, uh, of Cameroonians, uh, uh, Noto. Uh, oh, yes, Loya Noto. Uh -huh. oh, okay. Uh, in Quetta. Okay, in uh, Quetta, I became an ambassador. That's right. Okay. Uh, all, all these people, uh, for a whole generation, going back to Endele. Yes, Endele, yeah. Yeah, he was a doctor and was a leader of government business in Cameroon. He, in fact, led your exit mm -hmm. from Nigeria. And we in Nigeria could be saying to you, serves you right. Cameroonians, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. are you hearing that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, next, next time, you see, be careful you know, about uh, big neighbors and big, big friends. Uh, actually, uh, seriously, what happened was not quite fair because when what uh, happened when Br British Cameroon joined uh, French, Cameroon. French Cameroon was that um, it, the, your, the power moved to the north mm -hmm. and uh, somehow you had a very crafty Mm -hmm. ruler mm -hmm. uh, in the north, the Sadana of Sokoto, who was, was in the premier of northern Nigeria. Uh, uh, he managed to take the... Uh, northern part. Uh, the, no, mm -hmm. Yes, you see, into Nigeria, okay. where, while the south went to, 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 to Cameroon. Um, but that's where you are now. And uh, your business is, in my view, to find uh, the story about your condition.